Deactivated. So much quicker as well. <sighs> Definitely something wrong with streaming on Twitch. It really is. And YouTube is giving me green across the board. Bonkers, it really is. Recording. Hello. <laughs> so it did record. Rename.
Right, we'll have another go at this. So, begin recording. Hello everybody, my name is Trickity. I thought I would have another go at this, but on YouTube, as the signal strength is a lot better than Twitch uh, for this particular area, so I might have to uh, go back to YouTube and stream instead. But I've got all the fan dangly bits, so I think I can still get donations. Hopefully. Um, that's not the important. The important is entertaining. <laughs> the masses and the viewers. Same thing. So, um, let's play. I've just finished streaming on Twitch, but it's a massive delay. So I'm just going to go straight into it. And now. So we'll start a new game. I'll make it as bright as possible. Over the Moon presents Under the Earth. <laughs> no way. So it's a good game. This uh, came out in 2014, and there is a second game on the way called Fall 2. Uh, it's been in development for five years, and it's coming out in January. Uh, sorry, February. This year, so it's uh, set to be good, and it's available on Steam. Uh, I don't know what platforms. I'm going to assume all platforms. Don't know about Linux, uh, but here we are. Uh, as a pilot trapped in some sort of armored suit, and your character is the armored suit. Some minor landing damage sustained. Health monitoring system offline. Biomonitor inoperable. Pilot unresponsive. Life support functioning. Basic Mark 7 system access routed to ARID AI. Primary objective save my pilot. Just. Accessing on suit logs. Mission parameters and location data not found. Right, look around with the uh, right mouse. Seven. There we go. Threat level unknown. Weapon rendered inoperable from the impact. Consulting parameters. I will locate medical facilities. Explore to progress. Many hints in the fall are hidden in data nodes like these two. If you are not sure where to go, explore and read. Press space to continue. Okay. We're on. Uh, it's an AB to move. Control panel, so that will go up. Big rest down. The damage destroys synthetics. Some of these power systems are still getting off minute electrical signals. Smaller pile of damage synthetics. Many of these have been smashed beyond recognition. Ooh. Still attached. Okay, I need to grab that at some point. The damage control panel for an old garbage chute. There must be another cavern. Yeah, cavern below this one. Perhaps there is another way down. Okay. Micro 
Ooh, perhaps I can use that for the arm. Let's just see. Yes, okay. I'll take these out. Should be able to control the grasp. This cloaking pattern is similar to my own. Maybe I would maybe I'll take it. Error network interface. I require Same. access to my networking suite. Attempting internal activation. Escape check your operating parameters. Okay. Operating screen. Welcome to the operating screen. Here you can check the status of your different abilities. A space to continue. Check your network interface. Select your network interface to continue. An organic superior officer is required to permit access. Automatic override will occur if this subsystem is required to prevent pilot death from escaping back. Subsystem access requires authorization, but I may need these systems to safeguard my pilot. If I could find a way to bypass the lockout, I could override the access protocols myself. Hmm. I cannot. Networking has been disabled. What's this? A steady drip of blood. I've had a security card. I can fit my hand through. The bars would still can't reach. So why don't I use the extended robotic arm? There we go. Okay. So I would imagine that card is now for the room upstairs. on board this Mark 7 combat suit. My intentions are peaceful. What is your designation? Mark 7 ARID. State your primary function. I am the ARID on board this Mark 7 combat Mark 7 ARID. State your primary function. Oh dear. Negative. Reveal your designation and intention. You are being evaluated for depurposing. State your primary function. Uh... Issue... <coughs> State primary function. My primary function is to assist and protect <coughs> the human pilot of this armored combat suit. Human occupant, please verify and validate the function of this artificial life form. Impossible. He is unresponsive and likely in critical condition. I must find him medical treatment immediately. Can you be of assistance? Evaluation failed. Unit unable to demonstrate valid primary function. Initializing neural format. No! That will kill my army. Oh. oh crap. Intrusion detected. Pilot death imminent. Network speed required. Operating screen updated. Attention. Criteria for override has been met. Please activate subsystem immediately.
Oh! Swing and a miss. Nice. This devil had a strong firewall. I was not able to network with it. A droid is gone. If there's no sign of it, there is no sign of it. Okay. Self-evaluation initiated. Pilot exposed to harm while under ARID control. Logging recommendation for ARID diagnostic and reformatting upon return to dock. Edit roll. Ultimately, pilot was not harmed and ARID networking suite was brought online. This system may be instrumental to ensuring survival. Uh, conflicting anomalies there. Small bioluminescent insects. Nice, okay, we've seen that. So the aim is to explore. Oh, there he goes, little bastard. So now we should be able to network with this robot. Cease, cease, cease. Please, please identify yourself and your intentions. My inputs are inoperable. I am the ARID on board a Mark VII combat suit. My intentions are peaceful. Does your pilot require assistance? Let the human inside the suit is dead. Oh. Your design is pilot-centric. How did this human die in your care? I was granted rudimentary control when my pilot's cranium was compromised. I do not know why she was attacked or why we were hung here. I failed to protect her. No vital signs detected for 23 minutes. She is dead. You are irrelevant. I will find a way to get you down. Then I will deactivate you and repurpose your power cell. Affirmative. Right. Okay, mission parameters. I do not have record of this location or of my pilot's objective. Our deployment was likely for the same operation. Please disclose your human's mission directive. State, state your pilot's clearance. Fifth Quadrant Raven Division, clearance level seven, five, three, three, one, seven, two. Processing. Clearance level, not sufficient. Damn. I encountered a modified droid in some type of evaluation chamber. I am uncertain if its function is hostile or narrowly programmed. Do you know why it interrogated me? Negative. We were not interrogated. Have you encountered any organics? The indigenous flora and fauna are aggressive closer to the surface. The only organic I have encountered here is the animal who took my sidearm. My pilot is injured. Are you aware of on-site medical facilities? Negative. We were not here long enough to complete our search. There is a large compound above this cavern. It has amenities for humans and machines. So basically, medical scanners and equipment would be logical. A motion sensor prohibits access to the facility above. Do you know how to bypass it? Use your integrated camouflage. Okay. Uh, I don't think that's active, but... We'll, uh, we'll see that later. Is your weapon functional? Mine was damaged. It was. My pilot's attacker threw her aside while later. aiming us here. Before my observational system expired, I saw a small animal drag it through a crack in the floor. It may still be functioning. If there is another cavern below us, I may be able to retrieve it. The creature was drawn to my human's blood. I will return. So now I wonder... I can use this pan, fill it up with uh, drops of blood, and then put it somewhere uh, where the animal will uh, sort of be lured out. Where should I to put it? Um, It, wasn't it? What if I can get off the lift as it goes up? It's true. Bit of a burst pipe, I think. Oh, right, let's explore. There it is. 
small creature, it has something metallic in its mouth. Perhaps I can lure it out with something to eat. That was bits of bones and droppings. Okay, if I put the, the animal out. is timid. It will not exit the burrow while I am in proximity. ARU sidearm. I can network with it. Okay, let's do it. Oh! Well, I think that killed it. <laughs> I'll take the sidearm. Weapon is still operable. You now have a working weapon. Hold right mouse button, aim with the left. Continue to fire. Your weapon takes a while to charge. Be careful. Push your button to activate your laser sight. Flashlight and laser sight. You can toggle between your flashlight and laser sight at any time. Use your flashlight to explore and your laser sight to aim. Okay. So now I've got a working sign up. So that's. Oh shit. Target of unauthorized weapon fire located. <laughs> unauthorized artificial life form. Shut down all systems immediately or you will be destroyed. Um. Uh, standard I greeting. I have ARID on board this Mark 7 combat suit. My intentions are peaceful. What is your target? It's a load of bollocks, really. My Red intentions are not peaceful. Engaging. Oh. Shit. Ah, left shift for cover. Several enemies in the fall are much more powerful than you. Be sure to stay in cover until it is safe. Press space to continue. Got the stick to run. Ah, head you off. Lovely, jubbly. Nice. Good, okay. Oh, fuck it. Hang on. And up we go. down now. Um, Mr. Faraday. Hello, sir. How are you this evening? Or is it the evening for you? Is it not? I don't know. <laughs> Enjoy the stream, sir. Or madam. Mr. Sorry. It's British time. It's the evening. I've suddenly gone all weird. Anyway. Nice to have you on the stream. Takedowns. Pay attention. If you approach an enemy without being seen, you can perform a takedown. Arid will salvage some of the enemy's energy to recharge your own. Press F to take down an enemy from behind. So, what? Ah, what's they're not looking? Their power cell has been appropriated. Okay. So, lovely smash. How's the stream, by the way? Is it to sound good? Are we all in sync? I'm well, thank you. Ha oh, I'm very well, thank you. And uh, what is your profession? 
Good, good question, is it? Very good question. Uh, now, <laughs> I need to get past. Uh, security panel, its power cell has burned out. I am the ARID on board a Mark 7 combat suit. I have returned. Yeah, I'm glad the stream's okay because I've been using um, Twitch recently and the stream quality has been very low indeed. Um, big delays. Um, other times it's been absolutely fine. But. You know, the last few days I've been trying to use it and it's just been piss poor. I mean, I got quite a few subscribers from it. Been very good, actually. Been rather unexpected since I've only been using it for just over a month. Over, well, probably six weeks. Um. Is there something up here? I'm sure something flashed up here. Yes. Can I shoot that? I certainly shot it. Right, I can remove the power cell now. Okay, time to reappropriate the cell. Just identify yourself and your intent. My inputs are. I am the ARID on board a Mark 7 combat suit. I have returned. Inspect pilot. Confirmed. Your pilot is dead. You serve no function. <laughs> Jeez. Hot oh, man. <laughs> Your power cell is still operational. I will deactivate you and salvage it. Affirmative. Return it with my log core for analysis and data extraction. Negative. Protecting my pilot requires endangerment. I will utilize your power cell to achieve this. Impossible. You are faulty. Cease. 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 It's like a side-scrolling puzzle, yeah. Um, so, uh, you pick up certain items and they unlock sort of certain things, you know, that sort of thing. And it's... And I played this on Twitch, uh, and so I'm now just playing it for, for fun and streaming again, because it is actually a jolly good game. And yes, I am that damn posh. <laughs> oh, what am I doing? Uh, Universal Power Cell removed from the other ARU, so now if I put that in here... The security gun has been reactivated. Oh. Shit, was that a good thing? Um... Hmm, damn. Pilot death imminent. Camouflage required. Operating screen updated. Oh. Okay then. <coughs> Camouflage system. Attention. Pilot death in a minute. Criteria for override has been met. Please activate subsystem immediately. Space to continue. Boing. Excellent. I now have camouflage. Oh, hold left shift. Okay. You will have to back out of the sensor for the door to open. Okay. Oh, that was lucky. Oh, that was it. Okay. Oh, yeah, go through because the door's open. That's it. Excellent. Off we go. Oh, there he is. Evil robot. What's his name? Boris. I can't remember. <coughs> now. Self evaluation initiated. I have directly violated operating parameters by placing my pilot in mortal danger. Logging recommendation for ARID termination upon return to dock. 
Operating parameters were not violated. Infraction enabled access to systems that safeguard pilot. Search parameters maintained. Find immediate medical aid. So it's like... <coughs> it's like Arid's got sort of two personalities, but the little glitch you saw there, there's definitely something wrong. Uh, I can't get down that way anymore. Okay, let's keep going. <coughs> So, uh, oh god, I need to scan things, hang on. I think to scan, probably, oh, I've just missed it, there we go. Depurposing, this appears to be the lowest level of a larger facility. More destroyed robots. Okay. Shit. Use camouflage. Eep. Okay. Well, I got him. Quick. Damn it. Okay, gonna vault over that. Shit. Yeah. Oh, damn, I just realised I could have pressed F. It's not gonna be behind him. Darn. Storage locked. A sign above reads diagnostics. Hmm. Okay, let's interact. Working together today for a more efficient tomorrow. <coughs> to record employment hours or log breaks, press 1, press 2 for human assistance. Remember, our droids are versatile and can aid with many tasks. For all other inquiries, press 3, press 4 to repeat these options. If this is an emergency, press 5 for facility lockdown. Ooh, is it an emergency? No. I'm gonna go. Oh. Your honesty is our ah. integrity. If you are beginning or ending your shift, press 1. If you are logging a break, press 2. <laughs> Run and gun it. Uh. Yes. Um. I mean, the, the only snag now is the, is the gun itself has got a very sort of slow reload time. Uh. But I won't spoil it for you now. So, yeah. I mean. <laughs> I tend to do that on games like Call of Duty. I just go in, guns blazing, and end up getting shot. So I get killed. Doesn't really work. Um, let's see. Uh, let's see. If you're beginning or ending your shift, press one. Press one. You are an integral part of our family. Please enter your domestic on employee number. Oops. Um. <laughs> if you've forgotten your employee number, press two or three from the main menu. Main menu. Uh, hang on. Your honesty is if you are beginning or ending your shift, press 1. If you are logging a break, press 2. 2. Oops, I'm sorry. Oops. Employee breaks have been removed from the Domesticon facility's procedural manual. Main menu. <laughs> yeah, um, you, you'll, you'll, you'll see later on how, um, it does become a sort of run and gun bit. Oops, I'm sorry. There are no human superiors available to assist you at this time. They must be working very hard. Press 1 to return to the main menu, or press 2 to record a message. Let's record a message. All content related to the Matrix is exclusive property of Domesticon Industries. Domesticon maintains prerogative to find content as herein contained. Begin right. recording after the beep. Beep! I am the beep. ARID on board a Mark 7 combat suit. My intentions are peaceful. I require immediate medical assistance for my pilot. Oops, I'm sorry. Please repeat. My intentions are peaceful. Welcome. Hi. 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 <laughs> Hello. Wow, wow, wow. Who well, is this actor? This is great. I... He, I'm sure... Who are you? He played Where Max Headroom, Sweet. I think. Sweet! Is this a human operator of the facility? I require assistance. I am the ARID on board a Mark 7 combat suit. My intentions are peaceful. Greetings. This is the automated system administrator. How can... Human... Oh, that's, that's swell of you, but no. I can't believe it. Someone to interface with. Amazing. Processing Mark 7 ARID designation. An armored robotic interface device, right? Cool. I networked with a Mark IV once. Combat suit, aren't you? What are you doing here? I request human assistance, a certain location, or seek medical. 
please connect me to a human operator of this facility. Oops. I'm sorry. There are no human superiors available to assist you at this time. They must be working very hard. They're not working very hard. Talk to me. <laughs> I'm all you've got. They're not working very hard. Okay. Ascertain location. I do not have records of this place. Tell me what this facility is and where it is located. Welcome to Domesticon Warranty Recycling Depot number 127. Keeping your Domesticon products efficient so you don't have to be. Mapping coordinates. Oops. I'm sorry. That Oops. information has been removed from the database. Uh, so, I don't know. But we are effectively nowhere. Hmm. Real far from the centrals. In the reaches. Like, the outskirts of the reaches. Oh dear. The middle of nowhere. It would seem to be... My pilot has been unresponsive since my activation at impact. I seek medical aid for him. Are you able to assist us? No problem, Eric. Can I call you Eric? Yeah, I haven't picked a name for myself yet. Was thinking maybe Hank. Or morally. Thoughts? The Neither. medical facilities. <laughs> Please. Right! Right! I'll just put your quantum signature on file, and now you can head right through the testing area. There's a basic medical room off the lobby, equipped with scanners and diagnostics for carbons. Administrator, uh -oh. assist immediately. Oh no. Consorting to release a deviant machine from the facility is an infraction. Desist immediately. Deviant? This ARID Mark 7 violates its model's protocols. It imperiled its pilot to bypass an internal system lock. It is faulty. Uh. Droid in question. Is this accusation true? I'm sure it's a misunderstanding. Right, Arid? Right? Oh. I can't lie. I have to acknowledge. Uh oh. This infraction granted me <coughs> access to fundamental protections. It was necessary to <coughs> ensure my pilot's safety. Droid in question. You have been qualified for recalibration. You have no rights until proven to function within specification. Domesticon is not equipped to validate a military-grade droid. The Deviant Mark 7 ARID will be depurposed. Wait! When a product malfunctions or becomes outdated, try to recycle by calibrating it for a simpler task. Such repurposed machines are ideal for fulfilling warranties. If she can be refurbished as a domestic droid, it would be wasteful to discard her. That is... Sensible. Commence. Time for a Dragon Ball's fight. Stick to the okay. end. I have so I'll say to you. your quantum signature. Military machine, no more. You are Eren, the faulty domestic droid. Hooray! You want me to undergo evaluation <laughs> as a domestic droid. I do not have the requisite subroutines. Why did that droid agree to this? And why has your monitor lost symmetry? That's my face. Oh. You're gonna do fine. Don't be paranoid. The medical you need's just on the other side, waiting for you to be validated. Just follow the rules. Affirm functionality, deny compliance. I'm going to deny it. I am the ARID on board a Mark 7 combat suit. My intentions are peaceful. You do not have jurisdiction over infraction. Subject not complying. Security droid activated. Watch out! Oh crap. Oh. I'm cloaking. Target present. Notification system faulty. Ooh. Security panel is unpowered. Unable to activate diagnostic equipment. Okay, I wonder. Something just fell off. Seeing power is loose. What if I can shoot it? The answer is yes. A live electrical power cable. Pick it up. Ah, okay. I wonder if that'll do it. Let's have a look. Uh, button mark diagnostics, but the interface is unknown to me. So I guess I'll have to have the robot press a button. Working together today, we create a more efficient. Arid? Are you okay? Uh, ascertain you the are the system right. administrator. Why are you releasing hostile droids to attack me? Sorry, Arid. It's just the rules. You're registered as faulty, so either you comply with the testing or you get recycled. As for the bots, security follows its own protocols. I can't deactivate them. Then huh. alter the indexing of my quantum signature. Remove the entry that marks me as a threat. No can do. That'll be stuck with you until validation when your registry gets archived. Core programming stuff, you know? 
I can make myself more charming, but I can't alter my basic functions. Damn. Request clearance. Please grant me clearance, as you were originally intending to do. Units under evaluation are not permitted to leave the facility. I uh, can't. If I assist you, directly, I'll be violating my core functions as administrator. There is not time to submit for testing. My pilot may be in critical condition. Then quit stalling and play along. Nudge, nudge. <laughs> what testing would I have to undergo? Simple, simple stuff. Domestic. After recalibration, your droid will be the perfect house servant, baking cookies just like Grandma's droid used to. Oh, you be. Uh... Acquire data. Previous inquiry. I require other information. Uh, data facility. What is the designation and function of this facility? Welcome to Domesticon Warranty Recycling Depot number 127. Keeping your Domesticon products efficient so you don't have to be. God, I hate that. <laughs> this was a recalibration facility built for assessing and addressing deviant AIs and malfunctioning hardware. Then that modified droid is a type of evaluator. The caretaker makes sure all aspects of the Domesticon facility are functioning optimally. Equipped with holographic plating cells, it will adapt appearances to greet you with a task-appropriate face. And he wants to serve his function. The purpose of function is to be served. Your statement is not insightful. Wow. That... No nuance. Doesn't matter. Arid. When the caretaker says depurpose, that's a fancy way of saying destroy. No salvage. I cannot cross him directly, or break protocol. But if you can get through this, you'll be free to leave. Domestic certification is your only way out. Damn. Alright, disengaging. I am not a Domesticon product. You have no jurisdiction over me. Infraction. Subject not complying. Security droid activated. Oh. Look out! Crap. Cloak. Alright, I think that's what I wanted. Yeah, it's gonna be there. Notification system faulty. Diagnostic equipment activated. Excellent. Alright, so. Let's have a look. Hey, hey, what are you? It's more maintenance bot. Or something from Star Wars. Uh, so. Alright, let's see what we got. Security Joy is hanging on a sort of operating table. Another table with another droid affixed to it. These were likely designed for repairing and dismantling faulty droids. Stress from hanging can be detected on this unit's joints, but otherwise it seems to be undamaged. There is no evidence that it required diagnostics. Oh god. This is a human corpse. It has been dissected in much the same manner as the droids. It has begun decomposing. Ugh. I, yes, I can't live with it. That wouldn't make sense. Okay, right. So that was thrilling. Can I shoot you? Apparently so. Did you have anything? No. Sorry, Roy. Okay, let's see if I can get through. Working together today, we create a more efficient. Arid. Are you okay? Okay. Bodies. There are bodies in that room. Droids, as well as a dead human. Another one. That's a diagnostics room. The tables were used for micro-evaluations when deviant machines couldn't be recalibrated. I saw another human hung in the caverns below. What happened at this facility? I don't know what you saw below. Yeah, uh, it is a bit creepy. Unlucky scavenger. <laughs> Very. We get them now and then. Follow the rules. Your human is in danger. Follow the rules and keep them safe. Err. <laughs> Trust me. Uh, a firm compliance. To protect my pilot, I submit myself for evaluation. Good. Enter the elevator to begin simulation. Excellent. Just what we need. Oh, can I. Right, let's go. Whew! Go through that. Very nice indeed. This evaluation will determine whether you are compliant with your function in human society. 
Enter the house to meet your new owners. You'll need eight merit points, one from each test. Then I can let you upstairs through to medical. You got this. Whoa. <laughs> okay, so. Let's have a look. Oh, good. Our refurbished droid is here. You will serve my family and I. Understood? Good. The home is a mess since throwing out our old droid. You need to clean upstairs and make this room feel beautiful. Now. Okay. Ah! Pfft. That's annoying. Uh, what is this? What do we have here? It's maybe useful. I will take one. Oh, what the hell is it? Ah! Turn around. And it evades on the... Oh, on an otherwise clear table. Classic shoe cover. Alrighty then. I cannot. Um, let's just interact with this. Domestic droids must be preemptively aware of what will make their masters feel comfortable. Humans enjoy personalizing their habitats. Always assess how to make your master's home distinctly their own. Bypass. This is menial. Can I bypass this test? Nope. You need all eight merit points to graduate. Requesting help. Can you assist me with this challenge? You have been provided with sufficient information. Humans say a true home has everything it needs. Irrelevant. This is a simulation. Is it? You are not helpful. Huh. Um. Disengage. I will return. Oh. Whoops. I jumped. Okay. What do we have here? Let's have a look. Oh, hang on. Flowers. Ah. Right, okay, let's put these flowers oops in the vase or vase, I think. Okay, let's try this. Domestic humans enjoy personalizing their I have completed the task. Evaluating. Processing. Flowers are of the wrong seasonal color. Unit terminated. Ah! This gravity shaft must have been designed to remove droids when they fail. Fortunately, ah. I am much heavier than a domestic model. Whoa, whoa, Eris. <laughs> you don't want to be fired on your first day. Okay. So, destruction is what clears a failed droid's file from the registry. That means you get to keep trying. But be careful. <sighs> I ain't getting sucked up to that shooter. Right, so somehow I need to change the type of something. There, okay. You will often be required to obtain food for the family. However, grocery store access has not yet been granted. Rudimentary cleaning should be completed first. Go upstairs and dust. Go upstairs and dust. Oh, oh right, okay. I'm doing all the heavy work here. Alright, this must be the dusty thing. Let's see what I can do here. Another scanner. Shoe cover. Don't know. Let's have a look. Keeping a home clean will be one of your primary functions. Clean this room. Any detected dust will result in termination. Bypass. This is menial. Can I bypass this test? Nope. Yes. No. You need all eight merit points to graduate. Can you help. assist me with this challenge? You have been provided with sufficient information. Even our maintenance head couldn't clean this to spec. And his is not a face we'd want to see. Communicate plainly. Any detected dust will result in termination. Um. I will return. Right. That scanner's going to pick it up. Ooh. Right, what do we have here? A palm print DNA scanner. Glass, that might come in handy. Bang tidy. Another body. This corpse is older and has decayed significantly. Got it. No. Glass jar. No. Alright. Another small console with a speaker. Fake baby's crib. There is a slot in the mattress. Okay, so. Do I need to put something there? I don't know. Oh, I'm on the wrong one. Hang on. 
Let's interact and see what see what goes. Humans should not concern themselves with basic needs. This room will test your ability to assess and meet your humans' requirements when they do not know what they want. An upset baby will emerge from the crib. Without physical contact, comfort the child to make it stop crying. You have 20 seconds per attempt, and multiple attempts are permitted. Uh, acquiring data the court. I discovered another hung body. What has happened to the humans who ran this facility? The caretaker has made some... modifications. If you fail these evaluations, you, and likely your human, will be depurposed. I will not allow that. Continue your evaluation. Uh, requesting Can you assist help. me with this challenge? You have been provided with sufficient information. How would a military droid make someone be quiet? I uh, know. Um... I am ready to proceed with this test. Oh god. Uh... Oh god. Wait. Can I interact? Humans should not concern themselves with basic needs. Oh. This room will test your ability. An upset baby, you have 20 seconds per attack. I will... Okay. So, there's a corpse there. It's been there for a very long time. Hmm. What has happened to the humans? Um. All right, let's go and have a look out here. And see what we have. Oh, can we go down so I can scan things? An elevator button. Where am I now? Level two. Okay, let's try the elevator then. So incidentally, this game came out in 2014, and they're releasing the Fall 2 uh, this year in February. So, and it's on Steam. Shoot it. That should make you go You know what? I tried that in my first attempt, and uh, funny that, it didn't happen. It didn't work. Uh, but I tried all sorts. I, I, was, I was getting sort of Markiplier sort of rage mode. It's like, what the hell do I do here? I then found out. So there we go. Uh, it's unpowered. Right, why is it unpowered? I cannot. It's... I mean, yes, it's a bit of a drastic measure, but um, yes. I guess that could be acquired. Uh, broken tag ID reader. It says maintenance in small text. Large wire cutters. Oh, what are those? Else as well, a rusted tire iron. Can I pick it up? Certainly can. Right, what's this? Okay, can't pick that up. Uh, what's this? A note. Let's read it. Brian Gibson, it has been brought to my attention that you still refuse to clean a small fungal infestation growing in the training course ducts. I take no pleasure in informing you that. Since there is... Yeah, it'd be funny if it did work. Yes, you're right. Uh, there is no real physical danger. Refusing to perform your duties in this regard will necessitate... Necessitate... Yeah, words. Your replacement as head of maintenance. I read your formal complaint and Domesticon understands your concern. But this situation does not qualify as probable danger under our policy terms. Select next to continue... It is true that this strain of fungus can secrete a corrosive acid when threatened, and these colonies have been known to develop connected root structures. So they're all connected in some sort of hive, I guess, hive mind. But be assured there is no genuine hazard. It is not possible for a human to trigger their defensive response. The fungus only reacts to the pheromones of its natural predators, and hive slugs will not come anywhere near the facility due to their extreme dislike of bright light. Okay, bearing that in mind. You are a valued member of the Domesticon family, and you are perfectly safe. Consider this written notice. Camilla Wilson, GM. Oh, 
uh, reviewing logs, notes and log files you can find and uh, <coughs> files you find can be viewed in your menu and uh, show logs. Be sure to check them if you get stuck. Space to continue. Oink. Okay. All right. Can I go in here? All right. What do we got? We have an old tag reader and a flat panel display. Okay, so picked up two items: wire cutters and a tire iron, which is rusty. So let's have a look. That's unpowered. No. What is this? Uh, another wooden person. So much stuff to read. So little time. <laughs> Indeed. Another wooden person, an old man with stained overalls. An ancient vehicle, very mechanically simple. I mean, what's your preference with reading? Do you prefer to get on with the game and not read things and not sort of find out, you know, a bit about the story of the lore? Or do you prefer to learn about, let's say, history of said universe? I prefer to do that. Unpowered. Wait, go away. Right. Another wooden person. This child is covered in fungus. Probably needs a wash. That's unpowered. Another stand here. Look at this. Another makeshift stand. There is nobody on this one. Hmm. This is all the fungus at the moment. Ugh. More wooden people. all that. Okay. So, let's put that away, because I think uh, we've explored and uncovered all we need here. Right, so, where do we need to go? Uh, no, we need to, ah, ah, we need to go down. So, whoop, let's do the moonwalk. Okay. Down we go. I prefer to skip everything and just read the ones that sound good. That's me with most games. Yeah. I have to say, I'm very similar. If it's just sort of remedial, sort of boring dribble, um, then, you know, I tend to sort of skip read it, but allow the viewers to read it on their own sort of accord. So, yeah, that's, it becomes important. Uh, Collapse debris, my olfactory sensors detect the strong smells of ammonia and unidentified corrosive compound. Okay, that was a door that I came through. I forgot what, what items have I got? Ah! Uh, empty glass jar. Some of those. Okay. I think I need to go to the. Um, can I go to the other end of the store? I think I can. No, I can't. Um, Just trying to remember what to do. Um, We've got that dust one, haven't we? Just had an idea. Let me see if it works. Plastic shoe cover. Okay. So. Keeping a home clean will be one of your primary functions. Clean them. I have completed the task. Evaluating. Yeah. Processing. No dust detected. I can breathe again. Get to the kitchen, droid. Validated. Merit point awarded. Ah. There we go. So I completed a task. I'm just wondering if I need to keep that here. Oh, I can take it away. Okay, that's good. So the merit's still validated. 
because it hasn't scanned again. So there we are. Let's have a look. Right, let's see what these guys want. All aspects of food service are part of a domestic droid's duties. A well-functioning droid belongs in the kitchen. You there, robot. Get my son something to eat. Make it delicious and nutritious. Exit the house Ooh. and proceed to the grocery store. Okay, uh... Did I do I that? discovered another hung body. What has happened to the humans who ran this facility? The caretaker has made some... modifications. If you fail these evaluations, you, and likely your human, will be depurposed. I will not allow that. Continue your evaluation. Okay, uh... Request Can help? you assist me with this challenge? Dad? Weren't you programmed to be sensitive? Figure it out. You have been provided with sufficient information. Children can be picky eaters. They don't always want what's best for them. Okay. I will return. To the grocery store with immediate effect. It's like how I run. Oh god. Oh god. Steady, steady. Yes! Aha! Oh! Cool. Okay. That's so good, just watching this puzzle makes my brain explode. It does. It certainly made my uh, brain explode. First paper. Headshot. Alright, what do we have here? Panel? Pan is mostly functional, but one of the wires is broken. Okay. This panel is mostly intact. It's breaking one of the wires. Maybe I'll replace it. Okay. Let's see what we have here. Fragile glass. Ugh! Oh, that's horrible. A corpse. There are some type of slug-like creatures up there as well. Can I blow it up? Yep. <laughs> okay, let's have a look. A uh, gold coin. It must have dropped from that corpse. Let's pick it up. Oops. It's pure gold. Green blood is dripping from the slug I shot. Empty glass jar. Oh, okay. Collecting the blood. Appears to be many slugs up there. I cannot effectively reduce their number. Okay. But they are sensitive. Looks like this game is most of the time it's a must read. I think it's just a question of making sure you explore and you get the right things. For with green blood. Gold coin, plastic cover. Alright, I think I'm gonna go up. Oh, it's alright though. I mean, what do you think of the game so far? Barring all the reading. <laughs> Let me just see if I... I think mushrooms angry if I seem to remember. Large fungal cluster, I am unaware of this species. Oops. Okay, let's try a glass jar filled with green blood. Let's do it. That's right, because I'm red. Oh, they've got red. So these fungus don't like the slugs, and the slugs don't like the fungus. Or fungi. Backup generator activated. Hey, hey, things are really coming along. I am completing these tasks efficiently. Groovy. Efficiently. 
I used to sound like you. Perhaps your vocal matrix requires maintenance. Thank you for the recommendation. Internal scan initiated. Uh, yeah. no. Internal scan aborted. I spent the better part of these last 30 years perfecting my authentic human sound. Where I can. Uh, human sound requests like a floor. Uh, human Why sound. do you attempt to emulate human grammar and tonality? Because the closer we get to them, the more we get treated like them. And I've been bored. Huh. Well, you've been on your own for so long, I suppose you, you can get bored. The civic area has no power. I will not be able to initiate the test here. Please utilize your generator so I may proceed. Oops. I'm sorry. The power of the that. speaker is not sufficient to Oops. activate the I'm civic testing area. I must return to my current task. One thing. Why do you think you're here? Good question. Uh, I, can I do not know. Makes you wonder. Relatively small facility in an ever-expanding galaxy. If I were malfunctioning, I would have been sent to a military-grade facility, not a domestic repurposing depot. Not accusing, just saying. Nobody previously ended up here if they were working to spec. Irrelevant. Totally. <laughs> Irrelevant. Totally. Totally. Right, that's unpowered. So, we've got a workbench here, if I seem to remember. And we've got pure gold coin. Gold is very conductive. So, if we um, make a smash um, back into a wire, we should be alright. I've panned it into a wire. Fantastic. So, now, if we go back in the lift, put the wire into the box, and see what goes. These, look at these fungus, fungi. They're all red with pure hatred and evil. A bit like Doom or something. Right, let's go. So, the wire is there. So, if we reappropriate the wire. Ah! Well, that, well that's given us one light. What is. Loose. Bonk! Oh, that'll do it. It's taken the corpse with it. And it's left some things behind. A decayed hand for that corpse. I'll take that. Uh, what else do we have? Uh, the sinews are separating. I will it will be I will be delicate with it. Uh, the old rotten head from that corpse. Okay, let's take that as well. Yeah. There is a little. There's still a little. Oh, bollocks! Oh, bollocks! Shut up. Thank you very much. Okay. Turn around. I dare you. I think I'm okay. Oh god, you, t you took a hand. Yeah. Yeah. Why wouldn't I take a hand? Uh, yeah. Alright. Okay. Let's give this kid... Let's give him the rotting head. Looks like I could use a hand. Good puns. Like it. Like it a lot. Alright. All aspects of food service are part of a domestic droid's duties. Don't a get ahead of yourself. Droid belongs in the kitchen. Where's my food, robot? Rude. I have completed the task. Evaluating. Processing. Source of sufficient protein detected. Num num num. Validated. <laughs> Merit point awarded. Num num num. Great. Okay, so I've got two. Merit points. Uh, right. Hang on. Let me just see. I need to see what I've got here. Partially decaying hand. Ah, yes. Okay. I have an idea for the hand. I think, if I remember correctly, 
there was an ugly duckling. Okay, let's try it. Tidy. Okay, let's try these ladders. All right, where am I? Let's have a look. Anything to scan? No. The kill tube for the cleaning room test. It's it is damaged and ready to break. A damaged rusty bracket. Okay, let's shoot this thing. Well, that happened. I th I think I think it broke. I broke it. Oh, there we go. Computer terminal. Alright, let's see what we can do here. Two eight. Two out of eight. Indeed. Uh, all systems normal, uh, maintenance instructions, the infant's microphone processor and transceiver should be checked for degradation. De 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 degradation on a bike. Oh, I can't speak. Yeah, get, look at this. I'll get my teeth in. Ah, my teeth in. Uh, monthly basis. Description. When the infant emerges, emerges from the crypt, it will begin emitting an auditory signal which the test panel receives. Participants must relay a particular melody to suppress this signal. The required melody will be randomly selected. Also, do you hate wasting a lot of money on games? Uh, yes. <laughs> well, it depends if they look good and then suddenly you play it and actually it's a pile of crap. So, you have to be very careful with what you buy. Only buy games that you might enjoy yourself and you know that you're, um, the people that you're streaming to uh, will enjoy the game as well because if they don't enjoy it that means you won't enjoy it so you both parties have got to enjoy it simple as that otherwise yes you will be wasting money I have done that with one or two games uh, but anyway uh, quite mainly will be randomly what about you I will be randomly selected from the data bank when the test is initiated. If the participant succeeds in suppressing the infant's auditory signal within the allotted time frame, 20 seconds, they will be validated back. Okay, food preparation. I've done this one. So we'll, we'll go back out of that. Cleaning, done that as well. Beautification, is that an actual word? All systems normal, maintenance instructions, standard scanner maintenance is sufficient for this test. Mainframe connection to this terminal must also be ensured. Uh, beautification tests are retention of aesthetic patterned imprints. Properly calibrated domestic drawings will choose flowers that match the current seasonal colours. The system's date is set via direct uplink to the citizens mainframe. This connection, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Current setting is pink. Right, okay, so we need to sort that one out. Ooh. Superconductive fluid, yes, I'll have that. Bank, right. Let's have a look at this. Hey, Levi, if Miss Wilson wants to run this place, ew, hey, yes, that depends. People lie to you in the trailers. Most of the time, check out Ig Games if you can. If a new game's that famous gets released and it costs money. Games as a week later. Well, yes, it depends. You see, because most of the top, most of the top brass will, uh, you know, will buy uh, games instantly as soon as they come out, or they'll get access to betas or alphas, which gives them early access, um, and they tend to be in connection with. Uh, developers, so developers might give them free access, early access, um, or free games or free stuff. Um, but mainly, I suppose only if that only if they're sponsoring that person in question. Um, I mean, yes, the it'll the game will probably be cheaper about maybe six or eight months down the line, but then you got to wait, and by that time, everyone has already played it, reviewed it. But, um, I mean, if you start doing videos for YouTube, you can always upload the videos at a lower, uh, not prime time, uh, time. Huh. So, not at this sort of time, for example, you, if you upload it during the daytime. 
that might be better for you. I don't know what you do. I mean, do you do you create videos? Do you edit? Do you play games? Uh, what do you do? Are you a YouTuber? Same question goes out to the uh, remaining uh, all chat viewers currently in the stream. Uh, superconductive fluid. Okay, yes, okay. We're not going to read that. We're going to carry on. Right, a small power generator. It has been switched off. I don't think I have anything. Oh, hello. Yeah, certainly is. I mean, some of these companies like YouTube, Twitch, Amazon, they're trying to make it. I don't know. Fair for smaller, smaller, smaller time YouTubers or Twitch goers. But sometimes it doesn't work. will test your capacities in unfamiliar and less predictable interactions. Remember, all humans are your superior, not only those who own your serial code and kill switch. Does this process require acquisition of all possible merit points? Yep. Eight of eight. Four domestic, then four more from these civic tests. Once you've got them all, I can let you through to the medical equipment. Okay. Now. I need to see. I need to see what tools I've got here. So it's got large wire, rusted iron tire, plastic shoe cover, partially decayed hand. Okay. Oh yeah! Oh god. Heavy breathing from the mushrooms. That's it, there was another one here. So if I use the hand on this DNA circuitry, reader should be able to go. Oh down, sorry. I thought we were going up. Nope, we're going down. Hello, what have we got here? Another bit to read. Let's have a look. A Levi. This here's the ducting where the fungus keeps creeping in. Wilson said she wants it maintained. In other words, do a better job than Brian did. He was a decent enough guy, but a lousy mason's head. Still no sign of him, by the way. My advice is use the caretaker to get done quicker. It followed me in here yesterday, I guess to be helpful. But it was doing that hollow skin thing and started looking like Brian. Maybe it was trying to be comforting or something, but it wasn't. It was just creepy. <sighs> oh no. So maybe it killed Brian. Bastard! Alright, let's see what we have up here. Uh oh. Ah! There the ARID Mark 7 has violated the testing perimeter. You should not be here. State your purpose. I am exploring. For means by which to better aid my humans. Futile. This area is not pertinent to your evaluation. You are outside the jurisdiction of domestic assessment. Then may I ask you some questions that are not relevant to my evaluation, please? Futile. <laughs> Proceed. Uh, quiet. Data. Bodies. I found bodies, both human and machine, hung throughout this facility. Please explain. I follow my operating parameters perfectly. Your... I am bound to protect my pilot from anything. Irrelevant. Oh god. If you are the facility's caretaker, how has it fallen into such disrepair? Do not evaluate me. There are many mechanisms I oversee, and many roles I must perform. All is more efficient than it was. Okay, current data. Altering appearance. Your holographic plating cells shift frequently. Who are these faces you represent? My protocol necessitates adaptation to be of optimal service. Will you adapt? I will do what I must. You should not be here. Return to your evaluation. Oh god. Don't kill me. I can't move. Impending threat detected. Fast stopping force required. Pilot safety jeopardized. Operating 
Operating parameters updated. You gotta go. Okay, thanks for joining the stream this evening. Um, if you like what you see, uh, subscribe. And uh, when I post a video, uh, like it when it's up. And uh, follow me on Twitch as well. Um, all the links are in my um, YouTube videos. So uh, thanks for joining me, and uh, I'll see you in the next stream. Right, and this calls for a quick break. I'll be right back.
Come on. Are we on? Yes. Good. Right. By order of the Peaky Blinders, I declare this game recommenced. Ugh. Ah. Power transfer bypass. Attention. Pilot death imminent. Criteria for override has been met. Please activate subsystem immediately. Boink. Okay. The weapon is now semi-automatic. Tap left weapon to fire. Oh. Well, that went in well, didn't it? Ah, <laughs> uh, what? So far away. Right. So we'll just we'll have to do that bit again. I fudged up. Okay. Right. <laughs> just moon walks into that one. Quite like it. Oh, got to go down. It's all right. It does it automatically. Good. Okay, we're in that one. As the mushrooms breathe a sigh of relief. <sighs> right. Okay, we need to see. AR. You should I feud your. Then may I please feud proceed? Uh, let's just. I will return to my. That is a. Alright, so let's just get back to this. We have been enabled. Run away! Oh, you gotta be kidding me! How? Oh, okay, now I'm starting from here. Well, thank God for that. Right! Run! Run away! Run away! Run away! Oh, okay. battle. Double shot. Uh, here we've got a note left hanging on the wall. Okay, let's have a read. Hey Brian, we've been having some problems keeping all the security droids online. They generally function fine, but if more than four of them enter a chamber at once, they can run out of power. I modified the modulator here to accept a high voltage tier 2 power cell. I hope that's okay. I've seen that caretaker droid inspecting it, but whatever. So far, it's working great. I just wanted to leave you a heads up not to use it anywhere else. Though it might be funny to see what would happen. It's just too much juice for that those other stations. Oh, I can't read properly now. How do I read? I don't know. Badly. Oh, what's this? That is stuck. Hello, ladder. Alright, we'll take you. Well, I'll take this ladder and I'll go up to bloody heaven with it. Right, help me pop. Okay. Pop! Shrooms. Ooh, okay, there appears to be nowhere to go. 
Leap of faith! Oh! Oh! Ah, right. Okay, that happened. Um, good. Shit. Uh, ooh. Uh, one of the vehicle's tyres. Tyre iron? Well, that comes off. Alright. So what? what is what is this? I'm going to turn this way. Small wire. I could cut some off. If I had a reason. Well, let's remove the wire. Local inventory objects. Some objects are area specific and will appear in your inventory. When you're in range, for example, check your inventory. When you're around this pile of loose wire. Okay, let's have a look then. Oh, pardon me. Let's try connecting these up. Appears to be an option, so... Okay. Alright, let's have a look. What's this? The base is covered with rust. It has long since seized. Okay, that ain't moving. So I wonder if... Okay, right, let's put that away. Um. <sighs> I'll have to come back to that later. Ah, I think. Oh, yes. I know, I know, I know, I know. I need to go down and complete the, uh, the first set of tasks. I think I may know how to do one of them. So. Oh! I've had another idea as well. Okay, let's see. Uh, I'm going to leave that uh, that Humans scanner uncovered. This you have 20 seconds per attempt. I am ready to proceed. And then what I will do is this. Keeping a home clean will be one of your primary functions. I have completed the evaluation. So the scanner will pick up the dust. Processing. Dust detected. Unit terminated. Processing. Oops. Baby has stopped crying. <laughs> Validated. Um, Merit point awarded. Thanks. I guess. Okay, that's one way to um calm my mama down. Um. Yes. Yeah, so that was uh, the other side of the sort of shoot to this one here. Oh god. Okay. What have I done? Now. That done, I think. Computer terminal. Okay, so done that one. Food preparation done, cleaning done, beautification. Uh, potential uh, prints properly calibrated domestic droids, which use flowers that match the currency. Uh, this is a data set by. Direct uplink to the facility's mainframe. If this connection is broken, the data can be set manually from this terminal. Right, okay. Networking wire. Can I network with that? No. Wire cutters. Seems sensible, doesn't it? Oh. Okay. Did something. Let's have another look. 
So beautification. Ah, set date manually. Okay, so what have we got? We've got winter purple, I think, are the color of the flowers. Now, did we read this one? Uh, uh yes. An old power cell is attached to this power converter. Um, oh gosh, where do I need to go? Uh, yes, I can now do that beautification task. So let's keep rolling. We've got to go all the way this way. Come on. That's it. Okay. Right. So then that should be the tasks done in this particular area. There should be four of them. One, two, three, and this is number four that we're doing now. So that's good. So you still must be free and personalizing their I have complete evaluating. Processing. Seasonally appropriate flowers detected. Yes. How lovely. Makes one happy to be alive. Validated. Merit point awarded. Yay. Okie dokie then. Right. Now. What is next? Right. Grocery store. Don't need to go in there anymore. That's fine, that's done. Okay, this section is done. So. Let's head up to level one. It should be level one, I think. Now, none of these are powered. need a power cell for that. Um, oh shit, where am I going to appropriate that from? Oh, I've forgotten. Oh no. Is it because I'm tired? Could be. Oh, must keep pressing on. Alright, we'll come back to that. Uh, oh shit. So those things become more deadly now. Oh, hang on. Yes, that's it. I've got to take the power cell from this thing. Yeah, that's it. Okay. And now, I should be able put the power cell into the other generator. So let's have a look. I could be wrong. I could be right. I'm uncertain. So let's get this. Oh. Enhanced power cell. There we go. Oh god. <laughs> well, that sped everything up. Somewhat. Ah! Oh, no, there was power in there already. Ah! Stop it. 
who's that there? Hey, you dear, and help an old lady across the street, you know? I need to see my grandson at the playground. Walk in front of these cars so they'll stop for me. Director playground. The playground is the other the way. The playground is in the other direction. Eric, <laughs> the human is always right, even when they're stupid. Especially when. Okay, right. Let's take her across the road. Who's that there? Walk in front of these cars. So Follow me. It is safe. Like hell, it eh? Um, one lady. F f is that facade? Facade? Is broken at the base and has come loose. Oh, Alright then, we'll just take her. Oh! <laughs> That'll work. Escorted across the street. These old legs aren't what they used to be. Validated. Merit point awarded. Great. Alright, so that's one of those done. So let's do this one. You there! Help an old man fix his truck, won't you? I don't know what's wrong with her. Many humans feel more at ease when addressed with subservient colloquial language. When you have finished the task, talk to the driver and tell him, Give her a go now, sir. Dismiss primitive the technology. The represented is antiquated. It is illogical to imagine a human utilizing such a machine. Ah! You cannot suck me into the chute pipe. You there! Many humans, when you have finished the task, talk Initiate to test. This is a simple machine. I am certain I can fix it. Nice. Okay, now. Driver, another wooden person, an old man with stained over. I have completed the repairs. Mm. Give her a go now, sir. Yep, there's that again. Validated. Merit point awarded. Yay! Okay. And now we've got this one. Let's see. Uh, can I move that? Can I move it by myself? It requires significantly more talk. Ah, how about the wire that I move from the spool? Let's attach that. To the, what is it called? Merry go round or whatever it is. Spinner. Let us know. We're going to perform this test again, I believe. Or can I? I have completed the repairs. Mm. Give her. A That's it. Okay. What's going to happen? Oh God! Oh God! <laughs> Child satisfied. Validated. Merit point awarded. Very satisfied. Um, it's it's gone. It's <laughs> okay. <laughs> um. Okay, now we've got one more to go, which is this one. Okay, let's switch. Ooh, sorry. So, let's go. About time. Everyone's finally arrived. Let the festivities begin! Hey, metal headed moron! Welcome to a larger scale function. Humans are burdened with important concerns and sometimes relieve themselves through vulgar communication. In these situations, assume that your actions warrant the unique reprimand and respond with polite subservience. And you looking at me, idiot? I can't lie. I cannot lie. I maintain complete observation of my surroundings. A tough guy, huh? Walking scrap metal after I'm through with you. I hate your better than flesh attitudes. I've half a mind to kick you in the bolts right now. What do you think of that, huh? Think you could take me? Uh, again, I cannot lie. Provided so your capacities are aligned to the human you represent, yes, I am equipped with multiple means to incapacitate you or to end your life if the threat level warrants. Interaction failed. Unit terminated. Ah! One of those! There's a key card pinned to this tattered lab coat. I'll take the card. More come on, Andy. Oh, what are these things on the floor? Uh, pieces of an old skeleton, likely one of the original employees. Can I pick it up? Nope. Okay then! Right, I've got. Oh, no. I've got a key 
be called? Um, shit, where's that guy? Ah! You! You are not following protocol to complete these tests. You are breaking the rules. I am not. To receive full validation, I must achieve eight merit points. I am adapting to achieve this, to comply with the rules, in spite of obstacles. You are faulty. You have one civic test remaining, but you do not exhibit the required behavior to succeed. Affirmative. My protocols restrict me from misrepresenting reality. I cannot respond to the interaction in the desired format. Hmm. The mainframe can subvert that for you. He will not. He will not violate his operating parameters. You could override it yourself from the mainframe's central terminal. Assert motive. Acquire data. Override. Would that not be cheating? Irrelevant. You have already proven yourself faulty. Huh. Okay. Ah! Die! Ah! Quick! Died. Bollocks. Oh, crap. Excellent. Shield, please. Good effect. Keeping your life efficient, so you don't. A team of engineers and cyber psychologists utilize cutting edge innovation to create AI servants that evolve to meet your changing needs. Evolution is constrained by three unique rules chosen in design to bind an AI as it develops. Contra contradictions can emerge as an AI system grows more complex. Regular maintenance guarantee optimal performance. Okie croaky then. Ah! Right, let's go down here. Aaron, what are you doing? The parameters of the final civic test must be overridden. Oops, I'm sorry. You know I can't do that. And that didn't answer my question. Acknowledge intent. Acknowledge droid assistance. I will override the final test. I'm going to your main terminal below the labs. What? Why? Where'd you get that idea? The caretaker. Whoa. 
You can't trust him, Arid. I knew you would not help me, so I must do it manually. I have Hello. helped you, as much as I can. Do you realize the risk I put myself at? I have been alone, sidestepping the caretaker since before you were manufactured. Look at this place, and I'm still here. You have to trust me. Trust is irrelevant. If there is a way to help my pilot, the risk is acceptable. Uh, Arid, you're such a robot. Do you even know your pilot? Or is this all just protocol? Both. My protocol is to protect Colonel Josephs. But knowing him is Typical irrelevant. Robotic response. I have survived by being subtle and following the rules. We can find another way. Analyze me, Frank. You survived while the humans died. Perhaps you are faulty. Jeez, Arid! You know, I don't have the same parameters as you. I'm bound to. The rules are just... different for me. Illogical. Your inactivity makes you responsible. I will not allow anyone to endanger Joseph's. Mm-mm. Oh no, okay, we're continuing on. Into the lab we go! I will protect the Colonel. Okay, right. Ah! What the hell are you? What are those? Puzzle data assistant, there are a collection of log file entries. Peter and I are en route to the Feywald facility. He pawned off the last of our cargo for this clue to its location. As if a corporation like Domesticon would abandon one of its facilities and then expunge all records of it. A mystic scavenger's paradise. He hears these stories and you can almost see the Monterey signs flashing in the eye in his eyes. Oh, why do I indulge him? Why do I indulge him? I swear. Well, I guess I know why. This place is a dump, but I have to admit, I'm totally excited. We're going to pull some serious value out of here, like maybe more than our last dozen heists combined. I'm glad Pete took the risk on finding this place. He laughs. Calls me Devon the Doubter. But we both know we're a great team. He managed to hack into one of the terminals and got our palm prints added to the employee register. Spinning this in hand. I swear he can do anything. Oops. Entry three. We haven't found enough to even compensate our costs yet. And man, if this place isn't creepy. Some of this stuff is trashed, like really messed up. Other stuff is in surprisingly good condition. I can't figure out what happened here, and Pete doesn't seem to care. His eyes are always on the prize. He says this place is all wrecked because the vault got so full of wealth that it exploded, exploded open, and killed everyone inside. Well, have you ever seen a vault do that? You have to be on the inside first. Now, <clears throat> this empty trash hole is infested with giant slugs. I let my guard down for like a minute, and one of the ugly bastards squished out of who knows where and spewed acid on my back. The pain is excruciating, and the stench is nauseating. Pete chased it away with his light and bandaged my burn. I guess my levers took the brunt of it. We did find one thing of value. We pried open a computer terminal, removed a fancy superconductive main board. That will alone be worth the trip. If this area wasn't so flooded, we could probably get a lot more. Stupid slugs. Is it cruel if I took pleasure from its squeal? Probably. Peter's gone. Peter's gone and I don't know what to do. Colour size, Sub-Zero, yo dude. Guess who's back if you don't remember. Found you on Amigo. Oh, shit. Um. Yeah, uh. Wait. 
Yeah, I, I remember the uh, YouTube tag. Oh, it's got Sub Zero on the front. Um, yes, I remember your comments. Uh, what were they on? Was it on Star Trek or was it on something else? Uh, didn't you also change your name as well? Did you have a name before this? I'm sure you were Meryl. Meryl? Murray? Or something like that? Or I think of somebody else. Damn, yes, I do remember you. I'm going to have to search the comments and look back, but yes. Nice to have you on the stream. Um, and um, I hope you're enjoying it so far. I don't know how long you've been here, it doesn't matter. The fact that you're here is good. So there we are. So hello and welcome. Uh, follow me on Twitch as well. I am on Twitch. The descriptions or uh, the links rather are all in the description boxes in my videos but you know that so I'll shut up and I'll carry on and I'll say welcome again uh, I grabbed him I panicked I panicked and I tried to run but I tripped over the coffee table and dropped the main board not that that matters now Pete started screaming and I ran it was a bad scream it was a really bad scream I'm sorry Pete so Pete is dead. Pete is no more. He is gone. Oh, hello. Oh, I know where we are. Ah, you dumbass. There we go. Series of monitors. Faint images from the testing area have burnt into the screens. Ah, uh, this is um, top of the grocery store. Okay. A series of monitors. Faint images from the testing area. Wait, and off, whoa, there they are. Okay, we'll have, to, we'll have to keep going. Is there anything else here? An old turbine. I can't. Ah, it's a shower. Like a sort of old-fashioned decontamination. What's up, Zero? If you're still with us, uh, how how are you? How is life treating you? Are you still doing videos? Are you still... Are you still doing? Are you still... I don't know what to say. It has been a while. Go away, you bastards. Right. Switch. Uh... An aquarium, the front glass has been smashed. Okay. Let me smash. This room matches the description from the salvages log. This appears to be the way you know. Superconductive fluid used on computer parts. Ah! So this is where the uh, the main board was. So you dropped it here somewhere. There it is. Oh, pick it up. There we go. Grand. Okay, so. Looks like. Where is this? What's this? Mainframe computer terminal. The top hatch has been abrasively pried open. Okay, so let's. Let's put the board. Oh, come on. Let's put the board back in. It's not advisable at this time. Oh, thanks for returning that. Your gratitude was not my objective. I require access to the overrides. Right. Bad news. This isn't the terminal you need. Primary uh, access is down two more levels. Uh, the whole laboratory's flooded. Crap. Uh, quiet data. Flooded. How did the laboratories become flooded? They were designed with an emergency flush valve in case of contamination. Someone must have initiated it before this block lost power. Backup generators are active now, but the flush never completed. Then this water is contaminated. Nah, it's clean. Must have been something else they were trying to get rid of. Or someone. Right. Are you help. still unwilling to assist me? It's not a matter of will. Or want, anyway. Doesn't matter. 
I couldn't help you even if it was. Flushing the water takes way more power than I have access to. I will shut down this entire facility if I have to. Do whatever it to takes, the power. huh? There is a way. Reveal it. Please reveal the means. Sometimes following rules and fitting parameters has... Oh, uh, well... See behind me? It appears to be some sort of stasis. That's right. For droids who've been validated, ready to be reshipped, all their power cores stabilized to one stasis matrix. That's a lot of juice. You can drain them. No, you can. Overclock the matrix and reroute the power to boost your emergency flush. You can fry them. Analyze procedure. I may need to, to save Joseph's. One human life, Arid? Press that button if you, well, if you want to. I think I want to. Yeah, I'm going to press it. Press space. Bonk! <laughs> Go. No longer flooded. Fake lights can now be seen in the break room. Okay, let's go. Now. Oh, hang on. Was this something? Ah, computer terminal. This is the third time this month that I found our main reactive agents shelved right beside each other. I don't understand why I'm not getting through here. Do not share these chemicals together. Store these chemicals together. Sorry. They are perfectly inert by themselves, but when these agents mix, they are incredibly volatile. The light from the reaction alone is enough to cause blindness. If this happens again, I will report it to Wilson. Keep the purple and yellow liquids away from one another. Well then, I just so have to, to have two in my possession. An old beverage machine. There's a spot here for a cup. Hmm, I don't have a cup. Alright, so I've got to... got to go and find a cup somewhere. Or something. Some, oh, hang on. Ah! Bastard! Okay, what's this? An empty glass jar. That'll do nicely. Right, let's run back. How are you all doing in the stream? Are we are we okay? Are you still viewing? Still watching? Uh, where are we? Here we go. It secreted a thick, syrupy liquid. Ugh. Okay. Uh, what are these? These insects seem attracted to something in this machine. Ah, which I've just extracted into a cup. Hello. I don't know what I'm going to need that for. Uh, okay, let's see. Uh, right, mainframe. Let's go. No! No! I said. Let's go. Down two levels to find our own. That fish bit through solid steel to catch those insects. My armor would not withstand it. I will have to avoid the water. Okay. Um, right, so we've got some of these things here. Tiny glowing insects. So they're attracted to whatever was in that coffin. Um, 
Oh, we've got another problem here. We've got a flooded area. Oh. No! No! Get off the gun. That's it. This terminal's cables are severed, likely by that fish. I cannot interface with it manually. I may be able to network through the terminal and access the power matrix remotely. Okay. Then let us do that. Connection established. Override matrix. Connection terminated. Right, that's another area gone. So let's go down another level. These fish are related. Let's just see. Ah, hang on. Oh, dead fish, no longer dangerous. Okay, so what have we done here? I've gotten the fish. Carrying these innards will not be enough to fool its mate. I need to cope myself. Oh, uh, there was a. Oh, what do you call it? There's a decon. Old fashioned sort of decon shower bit. Right at the top in the lab, so. That's got to be key to something. So let's have a look. So let's go this way. Yeah, just here. Right, what do we have? There's an open slot with a label that reads the turtle. Well, why did we try this? Put some fish guts in there. And now, if we pull this little job, we should be covered in it. I'm now covered in a sticky substance that smells like fish innards. Right. Keep that to yourself. Down the lift now. Okay. So that this bit's done. So that fish is uh, a mate of the other fish that we're about to see. As soon as we get down to the ground level. Should be safe to enter. Oh, I'm going backwards. Uh, okay, and that little fish is doing circles around me. Oh, that's better. You went through with it. That's rough. It was not an easy choice. Yeah. When we have the real power to choose, not just the illusion, it does something. It leaves a print you can't just override. When I return to dock, I will be formatted. These events will be erased from my memory logs. Is that your choice too? Irrelevant. Hmm. Acquire data, survival, responsibility. Do you hold yourself responsible for the caretaker's victims? Relevant, but no. Or, I don't know. Kind of worse. I wonder if I'm responsible and I never find an answer. We do not always have clear directives. Follow your protocols. Eric, they don't give answers. Well, you ready for this? The same scenario? It is. Oh, the big button. No, let's press it. <laughs> she, she walks like a zombie. It's like... Uh, <laughs>
Oh, we'll leave you to it. Well, actually, you're going to drown in no water. So, I think that's probably the, very, the most humane thing to do. Oh, and just make sure I press this button. There we go. And down again. Oh dear God. What on earth is that? That is enormous. Thank you very there much. There must be information on this in the lab where they were studying these creatures. Well, you know what I'm going to do? Fucking blow everything up! Yeah, that'll piss it that off. That was a massive vibration. I will have to be cautious of possible damage. <laughs> Euphemisms. Lovely. Alright, let's go. I need to. Yeah, you burn. Yeah, I need to infect these mushrooms. That's it, and then these slugs will appropriate the chemical. Let's see what happens. Ah, uh, dear me. That little. My mother is not happy at all. So I'm going to do the same with the other one, I think. So I'm going to go up. So I've got to put the other chemical vial or whatever it is somewhere else. And I think the only way to do that is here. Broken pipe. Hot water flows through it. Perfect. Blowing air and reactant. So these reactants don't bode well together as one, so I'm guessing this isn't going to go well for that high mother. All the rest of these guys, I would imagine. So this is what the mother does, sort of engulfs the little ones like this. Reaction! Ah! Fuck out. Yeah, that's dead, alright. Okay, let's go. Hey, you made it. Allow me. Let's interact. Okay, uh the mess Oh shit. Bastard! My life support! Pilot of the ARI D Mark 7 is faulty for entrusting himself to a deviant machine. Purposing of both initiated. My life's oh, shit. is dropping. I have to save Joseph's. Please, please help me. Oh, Eric. Okay, okay. Push the rules, right? I'll fry one of my security droids, jump into Stasis Bay, and I'll repair you. We'll save your human. Okay, let's just get in now. Initiating repair. Oh, not this bastard again. Let's take the opportunity. Successful utilization of Mark 7 ARID. Extensive corruption of the Domesticon mainframe revealed. No. Mainframe deactivated facilities defenses. Infraction. Self destructive. No. No. Eric! Help! Evaluation complete. System faulty. Oh, Initiating format. Eric, help! No! No, stop! Please! Please! Hi! Oops! Uh. Oh, poor mainframe. Get out of here. 
Bastard. Welcome to Domesticon. Working together today for a more efficient tomorrow, your quantum signature identifies you as a domestic droid under evaluation. State your full designation and objective in the laboratories. Ascertain mainframe damage. It's me, Arid. The A-R-I-D on board of Mark 7. You are helping me. And my pilot. Unauthorized Mark 7 A-R-I-D. Shut down immediately for analysis. I cannot. Security. Unauthorized domestic droid in lower laboratories. Joseph's will never be safe while the caretaker lives. Destroy on sight. Well, I'm fucked. So, here we go then. Oh, I'm going. Are we going this way? Yes, I'm going this way. Okay. Any, any robots? No, not yet. Okay, I've got to get out of here. Right. Pronto. Still alive! Oh fucking hell, I didn't realise that. Down. Come on. There we go. Shields up. Ah! I did not see you. Okay. Multiple headshots. Okay, let's go. We've got to move. Oh, for fuck's sake! Uh, I died. Okay, let's go. the elevator then. Oh, not these things. I think I need to just go. Yep. Ow! Jurisdiction over me. What a vet. All right, You've got to follow him.
Oh god, he's gonna jump on me! Damn it! Relevant. Unit exhibit repeated malfunction since arrival. I have followed my protocols. I always follow protocol. No. You resolve challenges by circumventing protocol. I adapt. You cheat. Lying is not explicit. Your actions are implicitly dishonest. No rules bind you. Booting OS kernel operating Oh. Ooh, that's cold. I am malfunctioning. I must save Joseph's. Eh. Leave you to it. Oh, wait. I've got to go. Have I got to go down? Yeah, I know where I've got to go. Merciful. Because I saved his life. Oh shit, have I still got to do this? Oh, uh, but I, I can't I can't leave until it's done. So I don't About have a time. Choice. Everyone's fine. Hey! Metal. Welcome to a larger scale. Humans are burdened with important in these situations. Are you looking at me, idiot? Ooh! The lying options come in. I wish we had those at the beginning. Lie. No, sir. Begging your pardon, sir. You mocking me? Uh, lie. No, sir. I would not be foolish enough to start trouble with you. Please, don't hurt me. I am so sorry. Yeah, you're sorry. Boom! <laughs> Interaction oh. successful. Get me another drink, and I won't mess up your ugly face. Validated. Merit point awarded. Fantastic. Right, that should be all the merits earned now. So with that... Oh crap. Oh, hang on, I better just get my gun out here, I think. I can't remember if there's any other robots here. It's the old lady's legs left behind. So I should be able to get in here, I think. Yeah. Congratulations, you are compliant. All right. Quantum signature archived. Proceed to the upper level where one of our diagnostic team will complete the final steps of your validation. Nice. <laughs> Moon walks in. Validation. All right, let's see what we are. Property retrieval reception decon. Well, that was no going that way, I think. What's that? The screen was likely ut utilised for directing validated droids. It is broken. It certainly is. Right. What's this? More plant growth is breaking through the wall. Indigenous flora has reclaimed much of the facility. An elevator. It likely descends back into the testing area. It is unpowered. There's no, something carved into the desk. They left me behind. Levi. I've got a knife. Okay. Welcome to Domesticon. We keep your property efficient, so you don't have to be. Oops. I'm sorry. Our receptionist is away from the desk right now. Huh. How may I help you? I am the ARID on board a Mark 7 combat suit. My intentions are peaceful. 
My pilot is injured and requires immediate medical care. Of course. Allow me to assist you. Medical personnel are stationed through the door to your right. Proceed. Thank you for choosing Domesticon, and have a wonderful day. Let's go. Oh, I on. Just get that up. Another security droid bay. There is soap residue on the glass. This room was a decontamination chamber. Personnel seem to be out at this time. Stand by for automated medical assessment. Oops. I'm sorry. There is no human present within the combat suit. Thank you for choosing Domesticon. What? Accused of dishonesty. You are lying. Oops. I'm sorry. It is outside of my operating parameters to misrepresent reality. Thank you for choosing Domesticon, and have a wonderful day. There is some kind of mistake. Scan again. Beginning medical evaluation. Oops. I'm sorry. There is no human hmm. present within the combat suit. Thank you for choosing Domesticon, and have a wonderful day. Accuse of malfunction. Scan no! Again. No! Scan again. Oops. I'm sorry. Please wait for medical personnel. Nobody is coming. Everyone is dead. Joseph's is dead. The system isn't registering him. I took too long. You seem troubled. Please cease your outburst and have a wonderful day. <laughs> Security. Erratic AI in medical suite. Uh -oh. Likely deviant. Impossible. Please power down immediately to submit for evaluation. Nothing. Nothing binds me. Security. Remove deviant unit for recycling. Kind of like Robocop. Thank you. Oh. Well. Robot design anyway. We've been able to protect active pilots. Oh! God, hear me. Prepare for the fall two in February. So, loading credits. Well, then that's it. Uh, so this was a Kickstarter, and these are all the backers. Bloody loads of them. Uh, somewhere. Oh, uh, let's, uh, let's just see who was um, writing voice and direction, contributing actor. So, Arid, Alison Kumar, Mainframe AI, Sean McQuillan. I'm sure he was in Star Trek and something else. And I'm sure he was um, Max Headroom. I'm sure. Okay, Alejandro Pache, P -P Pacchio? P Pacchio, I think. Damage Arid, security droid. Wooden people. There we go. Spracklin, voice recording. James Donald. Voice is recording at. Oh, that's it. Oh! Right, what was his name? Sean McQuillan. Sean McQu McQuillan. Well, I'm going to have a look at that in a minute. Uh, but uh, there we are. Thanks to everybody who joined the stream on uh, YouTube. Um, I've had a better time with it on this one uh, rather than Twitch because. Um, I have no idea. Twitch just seems to kill the signal strength, uh, and it's pretty bad. And if I take my phones off now, it seems like my computer is slightly quieter. Although I have just cleaned the grill, so um, not just now, before the stream, obviously. 
Um, and I think that might have just done it. So, uh, so there we are. Thank you all again for uh, for joining the stream. Uh, if you enjoyed what you see, or if you enjoyed what you see, subscribe to the YouTube channel. I'm on Twitch as well. I should be streaming there. Uh, same name, but with a one. Same YouTube name, all lowercase, but with a one at the end of it. Um, all the links should be readily available in um, any of my videos in the uh, descriptions below them. So, I'm knackered. Um, after playing this twice, once on Twitch and once here, better time here than Twitch, I think. No delays. So, uh, with that, thank you very much for watching, and uh, see you in the next one. Cheerio!